All right, guys, for those of you who are sitting home, welcome to Time Valley of Tennis. For those of you who are still can't get out, this is the time to go out and play some tennis because you might not gonna have it for too long. So we are catching last days being outside. We're gonna post as many videos as we can because after that, we might have to go and sit at home for a while. So with that said, let's jump into it and start playing some tennis today. So first drill that we're gonna work on, it's actually uh, something that people have been asking for a while is how do I get into that? What type of strategy do I use to get into the net? And uh, we've seen a lot when uh, players on you know level from 2.5 to 4.5, even higher levels sometimes, struggle to get into the net and they don't know when to go, which shots to pick. So today we're going to work on how to use your slice backhand uh, to come into the net. So specifically slice down the line. And why would we go down the line is for one main reason, because when you guys come into the net, and this is where people get confused, they hit the, uh, let's say, approach shot, they get into net, and they try to stay right in the middle. Now, actually, this is a wrong decision to make because you actually have to follow your ball. So, for example, if I'm going uh, cross court, I'll actually have to stay on the right hand side from the middle of the court in order to protect down the line shot. And then you're going to ask, but why do you leave so much cross court? It's actually because I can go diagonal, I can go diagonal across the ball. So, people are not going to pass me much. Uh, on the cross court unless I'm moving parallel to the net and I open up that spot because you can uh, recover the ball in the air so in the, with that said if I'm making one step from here and I'm sticking my racket out your opponent has to send the ball about five six away from the net with an angle but that said it's very hard ball so you want to protect the line more and that's when you can hit a hard passing shot so if you hit down the line, this is what happens. If I'm going, let's say, hitting the ball from here and I'm going with the cross court, this is a longer distance to go to the net. So I can just chip the ball down the line and follow my ball, which is the shorter distance. And if I have to cover cross court, it will be with my forehand, which is easier volley. So with that said, let's start doing the drill. It's a live ball drill. We're going to rally on the cross court. As soon as I get a shorter ball, I'm going to take the ball down the line with a slice come into the net and see what happens. All right, guys, thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Please comment on the link below. We're going to have lots of time on our hands to reply to your comments right now. And also go on the Instagram, follow. We're going to have some daily videos for you guys, some of them fun, some of them just tips and things like that. And please send us matches on Instagram as well. We're going to try to reply to those as well. Thank you so much, guys.